In this video, we'll show you how to link at a tool web module with a Qualtrics questionnaire. To do this, you'll need two questionnaires. The first one can be used as a consent form, whilst the second one can be your questionnaire. Let's head back to our first questionnaire. In the survey flow tab, click add an element and add an end of survey element. Click customize and then redirect to a URL. In this text entry space, we would paste in the link to our tutorial module. Let's head to tutorial web and locate our module. If we press show URL, we can copy this and paste it back into the first questionnaire. Click OK and apply to save our changes. Next, we'll head to our second questionnaire. Navigate to the distributions tab and copy the anonymous link. Head back to the tool and press edit on our module. In the redirect to URL section, paste in your link to questionnaire two. The tool will now automatically append the session token and exit ID to Qualtrics. Save and exit to save these settings. In your second questionnaire, navigate to survey and survey flow. Here, we'll add a new element of embedded data. Type exit ID and session token as so. Apply those settings. Now that everything is linked, we can publish each of our questionnaires and our tutorial module. Now that that's published, we'll check that it's all working by copying the link to our first survey. This is the link that you would send out to participants. The first questionnaire is displayed and when the answers are submitted, we're then redirected to the tutorial task. At the end of the tutorial task, we're then automatically redirected to the second questionnaire. Finally, let's check that our data has synchronized. In questionnaire two, navigate to data and analysis and wait for your data to load. Click column chooser and select the embedded data. We can see our survey responses and session token have appeared. Now, when we download our Qualtrics and tool data, each participant's data can be linked via their unique session token. Thanks for watching.